This Kubernetes cluster is about to make me pull my hair out, especially Loki. I've been fiddling with Loki for the last two hours trying to figure out why the stupid sidecar would not load. I figured out the sidecar pod was in a crash state. It had over 2,000 crashes, so it had just been crashing for weeks now. I don't know. I didn't bother to like look into how long ago it started crashing. After checking the logs, I figured out that the sidecar was trying to write to a temp directory, but it did not have access to a temp directory. So the Python that was running in the pod was just like trying to assign uh, a temp directory to this temp dir variable and it couldn't do it. In my Helm release file, there was no temp directory exposed. So then I go look at the Helm chart and the values and I realized that you can't expose a temp directory to the sidecar. I learned about post rendering, which allows you to modify your YAML files before they get applied to the cluster. I was able to patch the sidecar and mount a temp directory to the sidecar with the patch. After I reconciled with Flux and did a restart of the Loki stateful set, both pods came online, everything is healthy, it feels so good. I wanted to use the Loki rules sidecar because that's what allows you to set rules to send to something like alert manager. Say if some of your log files, you have a bunch of error messages within a short period of time, you can have a rule set that will alert you when that happens. And I wanted to use that functionality. I'm super stoked that I got Loki working again. I just wish it didn't take me two hours to fix it. I'll see y'all in the next one.